Hello, this clip is a how to using Artemis and Apollo, a program for creating unlock files. In my hand right now is the Oppo Reno 12 Fads 5G model. The first step is to read back file or save the file first. In this video, I will use the unlock tool to save the file. Then boot the device by selecting preloader off B3 the mobile phone and turn off the device. Done, then press hold plus volume and plug in the cable after the program connect the mobile phone, and then it will read the partition and the details of the device for us to read back. The format file must be of type scatter. We select scatter and then choose the location to store the file in. I will choose to store the video clip in folder Apollo to make it easier to remember. Then press select folder so that the program will store the file in that folder. Now it may take a lot of time, the strength of each person's computer as well. Yes, after we have finished collecting the files. Then, minimize the unlock tool program and save it first, then go to the Artemis program to unlock. As for the signal value, go out first for us. You can go in and open add. The file that we will select is the protect one file. Option will be select Reno 12 Threads 5G, and then go to the folder where we keep the file. Open the file that needs to be edited. Then press lock and the program will calculate the new file value. Give it and then write it back in the partition protect one box again. To make it easier to remember, I'll move the file. It's in the same folder as well. Now we then go back to the unlock tool program to choose to write the files back in. Right click on the partition, select write, and select the files that we have edited. Then the program will write then clean the machine one time. In order to unlock the code and FRP inside. After pressing the code and FRP, then pressing reboot one time, the mobile phone will turn on. Set your mobile phone to the home page. In the meantime, I will open the Apollo program and wait to edit the file. We will create a new one. But the condition is we have to open the USB debugger or add B first. Before doing that, I recommend that you check. Let's check first whether our mobile phone now has all the MA baseband values to make sure that our mobile phone has no problems. Yes, then try checking the SIM lock status completely before continuing to work. In the mobile's phone right now, the status is unlocked. It is considered usable. Base Open the settings app or settings from there. Scroll to the bottom about phone or about and select the version. It's the top one, version number. Tap it a total of seven times. The bottom will say open. Developer mode is complete. Press back twice to go to advanced settings. Then select open developer mode. Scroll down to find USB debugging or debugging via USB. Now go to the Apollo motor program and select read info. The program will work through AdB. Give permission to the mobile phone one time and then press read info again to get details. Then press get data for method. Save it in the program first. You must always do it. As for the ODA version, we will count after it as a letter like here as a 11, then enter it as version 11 and press OK. The program will select a file, which is the file in on this page, we will choose the super file, which is the largest size. We choose to open the super file, and the program will automatically scan, edit the lock file, and ODA it for you. This step may take some time. Yes, the newly created file will be in previously, the new name was mod unders, followed by a name such as super, which would be mod unders the super. While creating the file, we will see that method 5 calls for the use of methods 2 and 4. If both methods are found, it means that method 5 works perfectly. Then let us go to another mode to make corrections. As for the VubMeta file, because this version has new security to protect it, it cannot you can use the method to unlock it without unlock. So if any version needs to unlock the bootloader, we need to patch every VubMeta. Notice that the program says there will be a file created. The new one comes up as mod underscore VubMeta. We press every one, and the program will filter for us which ones are Vabeta.
after patch is complete, it is recommended to do move all files named mod underscore to the same folder to make it easier to work. After this, we will close the Artemis and Apollo programs and then return to the Unlock Tool program to write the entire file. After that, go back in and boot the mobile device again, then turn off the mobile phone. Closely hold plus vault enter after the program encounters your mobile phone. This time, let us unlock the bootloader first. After selecting Unlock Bootloader, the program then let us write all the files that we edited one partition at a time. The method is not difficult. We right-click on that part atop and, and select Write File and select the correct file to match the partition that we will write until all seven files are complete. After writing all the files, format the machine again in order for the device to clear the old settings. Then select Reboot. This time the phone will turn on Sometime Phone will be Boot Loop or Auto Enter to the Recovery page. Let us format data at once. After this, we will set the same settings again. After going to the main page, let us do checking that the software version of Has the device been changed yet? Go to the settings. Then select about phone or about. Then look at the software version. Is it a version that ends with M1 or not? If you change it to M1, it means that it is correct. Now you did a test and an internet Wi-Fi connect to see results there problems or not then you can submit the work.